it's a bright sunny day at the construction HQ. Aww, Bump hasn't quite woken up yet. He doesn't like mornings. Here are today's plans. They're going to build a pond. How exciting! This'll be so much fun! First, it's up to Diggly to dig the hole. Good job, Diggly. Next, Bump pushes the dirt away and Daisy puts some stones around the edge of the pond. Great! Now all that's left is to fill it up with water. Better get out of the way, Diggly. Bump's turned on the tap and the water runs through the hose. Hmm, Daisy doesn't like that stone. Oh no! The stone landed on the hose! Now the water can't get through. Quick! They need to do something. Daisy's got an idea. She's going to hit the stone. Splash! Uh oh. Now the hose has sprung a leak. The water is spraying everywhere. But Mrs. Skip knows what to do. They can use a band aid to stick the hole shut. There. Good job, everyone. Now the water can flow again. Mr. Rubble wonders where the water's got to. Oops! Mr. Rubble has ended up in the pond. But that's okay. He thinks it's funny too. Splash! Great work, guys! Everyone is so excited for Christmas at the construction site. But there's still work to do. Today, they're building a pylon. But Mrs. Skip has plans for a Christmas tree. Wow! But Mr. Rubble says that there's no time for Christmas trees. They have work to do. Everyone is so disappointed. Soon everyone is working hard on building the pylon. But what's Mrs. Skip up to? Oh, she started to make a Christmas tree in secret. But she needs a bit of help. Everyone is still hard at work. Oh, Diggly's telling Daisy about the secret Christmas tree. They're building it out of rubbish. It's a recycled Christmas tree. There's Bump and CJ. They can help too! Everyone's finding things they can recycle for the Christmas tree. Mr. Rubble wonders what everyone's up to. Some planks, green paint, the tree is really taking shape. Ornament and a satellite disc for the star. Hooray! And the pylon is finished too. Good job, everyone. But Mr. Rubble wonders where everyone's got to. Yeah. Oh, he's found the secret tree. What's Mr. Rubble doing? Oh, he's helping. He's plugging in the lights. He's not angry. He's happy. Merry Christmas, everyone. The gang are getting ready for Halloween. And today, they're building a pumpkin stand at the farm. Diggly is putting on the finishing touches. Oh look, it's Terry Tractor. He looks very happy with his new stand. Oops, all the pumpkins are falling. Oh dear. Daisy is covered in pumpkin. She looks a bit scary. She looks like a pumpkin monster. Look, it's Buster and Scout. 
Ah! Daisy has scared them away. Hmm, it's given Daisy an idea. Buster and Scout are terrified of the pumpkin monster. There it is! Diggly knows it's only Daisy. And it's given him an idea for a prank as well. Daisy is trying to scare Diggly. But what's that? Boo! Don't worry, Daisy. It was just Scout, Diggly and Buster, dressed up like pumpkins. Here's Terry the tractor to check up on them. What's all this? What a scary bunch! Terry is rewarding them all for their hard work with a fruit basket. Yum, yum. It's another sunny day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they're building today. Oh, nice. A barn. This looks like a good spot to start building. First, they need to lay these planks down. Ha! Nice one, Bum. But what's this? A bunny? Oh no! They're building the barn all over the bunny's home. But I don't think the crew have noticed. The bunnies are definitely not happy. What are they going to do? This bunny has jumped up onto the bricks. What is she doing? She's trying to take one of the bricks. Oh, here comes Bump. I don't think he noticed the bunny. Now Daisy has put some pipes down. And that bunny has pushed them over. And now the bunny has taken that pipe. What are they up to? Now Diggly is laying out his tools. But one of the bunnies is moving his hammer. And now they're moving his screwdriver too. Diggly doesn't get it. Where did his tools go? The whole construction crew are very confused. How do things keep going missing? It's such a mystery. Wait! Now they know the bunnies are the ones moving everything. But why? Oh! They've moved everything into another field. They want the crew to build the barn over there instead. So it's not on top of their rabbit holes. Now Daisy gets it. Now the crew have moved all the building materials into the other field, just like the bunnies wanted. In no time at all, the barn is all finished, all good in the new field. The bunnies are so happy. Well done, team. Hey, it's Diggly. Time for a hard day's work on the construction site. But wait, what has Diggly seen? Oh, wow, a robot digger. I wonder what that's doing here. Johnny is going to turn the machine on. Oh, that's it. The robot looks ready to work. Now the construction vehicles are hard at work. Diggly is digging a trench, but now the robot digger is here to help. Look out, Diggly. The robot is digging very fast. Let's just stay out of its way. Look at the robot digger go. Dozer has to move fast to keep up. Whoa, the robot digger has finished its job already. Oh, poor Diggly. He feels useless now that the robot has done his job for him. What's this? A drip of water has hit the robot. I don't think the robot is waterproof. Oh no, it's going haywire. It's smashing up all the construction sites. Somebody needs to stop it. Diggly and Dozer are jumping into action. Dozer is holding the robot back, but he can't hold it forever. Quick, Diggly. Phew, the robot is up. Well done, Diggly and Dozer. You saved the day. 
But what can we do with the robot now? It's a very hot day today. Oh, Diggly has turned the robot digger into a robot fan. How very clever of him. Diggly and Daisy are so excited for Halloween. They can't wait to go trick-or-treating tonight. Oh, but... Oh dear, Mr Rubble says they've still got work to do. Diggly and Daisy are working hard on the construction site. There's Buster and Scout going trick-or-treating. Diggly and Daisy wish that they could join them. Here comes Mrs Skip. Look, she's given them Halloween masks. That's given Daisy an idea. What's that noise? Trick or treat! Daisy is trick or treating Mr. Rubble and he doesn't recognise her. He's given her some sweets. Maybe they can go trick or treating after all. <laughs> now Diggly's going to try. Trick or treat! <laughs> Mr. Rubble doesn't recognise Diggly either, so gives him some sweets. But, hmm, that trick or treater looked kind of familiar. Mr. Rubble's going to investigate. Uh oh. Daisy's hiding, Diggly's running. Mr. Rubble thinks something funny is going on. A trail of sweets. He's chasing after Diggly. Oops! Oh dear, Mr. Rubble found them. He caught them playing instead of working. But... Aw, he's brought them some more sweets. Mr. Rubble is a big softy, really. Now he's letting Diggly and Daisy go trick-or-treating. Happy Halloween, everyone. Look, it's the town zoo. And there's Bandit Bus. What's he up to this time? Oh no, he's unlocking the zoo doors. <laughs> and now he's opening them. The zoo animals might escape. Oh dear, that baby lion has just got out. Hey, it's Diggly and Daisy driving along oh. the road. And there's Tony the truck. Hi, Tony. They've all got work to do. Tony's on his way to deliver some boxes. Look, the baby lion. Tony is scared. He's running away. Oh. Diggly and Daisy wonder what he's running from. Hmm. Oh. The baby lion is still there. Diggly and Daisy are frightened. Mm. Lions can be dangerous. Oh. But they can't just leave him to roam free. He needs to go back to the zoo. I think Ooh. Diggly has a plan. Look. A toy mouse on a string. The baby lion is chasing it. He'll follow it anywhere. Oh, I see. <laughs> Diggly and Daisy are pulling the string. They're going to use it to lead the baby lion all the way back to the zoo. Ooh. Oops. Daisy's knocked the sign. Now they don't know which way the zoo is. Maybe it's this way? Oh, dear. They've gone round in a circle. Well, maybe it's this way. Oh. Maybe not. Hmm. Oh no! The baby lion has caught up. But wait, he doesn't seem so scary. He just wants to play. <laughs> there, the baby lion is back at the zoo, safe and sound. Good job, Diggly and Daisy. Is the construction crew hard at work building the foundations for a brand new building? Uh oh, I think it's going to rain. I don't like the look of those storm clouds. Time to get cover. Wait, there's Scout. Watch out, Scout. She's skidding. Careful, Daisy. Oh dear, oh dear. Daisy accidentally hit the girders. Look out, everyone. The whole thing is falling down. Oh no. Scout is trapped down that pit with the girders on top. 
You have to get her out quick, guys, before the rainwater fills the pit up. I think Diggly is going to move the girders first. Wait, careful. Those girders could oh. fall on top of Scout. That was a close one. I think CJ the cement mixer has an idea. Oh, I see. If we use cement to stick all the girders together, we can drag them out in one go. Clever. Go on, Dozer. Drag those heavy girders out of the way. Great! Now the girders are gone. It's up to Diggly and Johnny to dig Scout a way out. Hurry up, guys. The water is getting deeper. You can do it. Diggly and Johnny are digging as fast as they can. Almost there. Scout can drive out now. Well done, Diggly and Johnny. You saved the day in the nick of time. And look now, the sun is coming out again. Good job, everyone. See you again next time. Look. Today the construction crew are going to build a canal. That will be great fun. First they need to dig a trench for the water. Bump and CJ want to help, but... Looks like Diggly and Daisy have it covered. Maybe they don't need Bump and CJ. In no time at all, the trench is dug. Good job, everyone. Daisy's ready. And smash. Here comes the water. It'll reach Diggly and Mr. Rubble any second. Any second. Where is it? There must be a blockage somewhere. Diggly's taking a look. Look, it's spilling out over there. Quick, Daisy needs to fix it. Oh dear, how will they plug this gap? CJ, of course. She can use her cement to fix the leak. Good job, everyone. But now look. That rock is blocking the canal. That rock is too heavy for Daisy to move. But here comes Bump. He can move that. Hooray! Good work. There. At last, the water has filled up the canal. They couldn't have done it without CJ and Bump's help. Good teamwork. Look, it's Diggly. I think he wants to lift that big girder. There's Johnny. He has no problem lifting heavy loads. He's tall and strong. But Diggly is only little. And that girder is very heavy. Oh, Diggly can't reach high enough. Poor Diggly. Here's Dozer. He wants to cheer Diggly up. Being big and strong isn't everything. Everybody has different things they're good at. There's no need to be upset. <laughs> I think Diggly has a plan. He's got a barrel. And Dozer has a plank of wood. Now Diggly's up on the roof. Dozer's put a crate of bricks on the plank. Is it a seesaw? Oh, I see. It's a catapult. They can use it to bounce bricks up onto the roof. Very clever, Diggly. Johnny is still lifting the heavy bricks up onto the roof. But look, Diggly can bounce them up easily. He's using his brain to solve a problem. Look, now Daisy. 
Daisy wants a turn. <laughs> it's so much fun using Diggly's new invention. They'll have moved all the bricks in no time. Diggly may not be the strongest or the tallest, but he can be a very big help if he tries hard. <laughs> well done, Diggly. It's a fun snowy day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they're building today. An ice rink? Amazing! Here's the frozen pond. To turn it into a skating rink, they need to put up the soft safety barriers. Uh-oh, Bump's moving the snow, but he's not seen Mr. Rubble. Oops, Mr. Rubble is on the ice. His wheels can't grip. He's sliding. Quick, Diggly and Daisy can move the barrier so he doesn't crash. Phew, nice work. But now Mr. Rubble is sliding towards the market stall. Mrs. Skip has to bounce him back. Good job, Mrs. Skip. Bounce, bounce. Mr. Rubble's going back and forth like a ping pong ball. But I think Diggly has a plan. They can bounce him into this pile of snow. Daisy's bouncing him towards the snow pile. Whoosh! Is Mr. Rubble okay? Oh, there he is! Good job, everyone! <laughs> now the ice rink can be finished in no time. Diggly and Daisy are having fun skating on it. But what's this? Skates? Now Mr. Rubble can join in and skate too! Whoa, whoa there! He's got it! It's so much fun to go ice skating! Mr. Rubble is heading off for a much needed holiday. So today's building work is up to Diggly and Daisy. And today they need to build a brick wall. That looks pretty easy. Time to get started. Daisy thinks they should start the wall here. Oh, Diggly doesn't think so. He thinks they should start here. Daisy doesn't agree. Maybe they could start in the middle. Diggly and Daisy disagree. They're not going to work together. And poor CJ is stuck in the middle. Diggly and Daisy are each going to build their own wall the way they think it should be built. Each of them wants their wall to be the best. They're building faster and faster. Poor CJ is struggling to keep up with all the cement they need. Something is wrong. They've been so focused on their own walls that now they've trapped themselves in. Hmm, this is no good. But I think Daisy has an idea. Yes, Diggly agrees. They shouldn't fight. They should work together to fix the problem. Daisy has knocked her bit of the wall down. Now Diggly is knocking his down too. There, now they can start over again. But this time, Diggly and Daisy will work together and build one big wall that'll be nice and strong. They put all the bricks in place. Hooray! The wall is finished. Daisy's happy with it. And so is Diggly. Good teamwork, guys. CJ is so happy they're friends again. It's a new day on the construction site. Oh dear, Bump is so slow. He's going to be late. Mr. Rubble doesn't like it when people are late. Today they're going to build a sand pit. How exciting! Diggly has dug the hole in no time at all. Oh dear, it takes Bump a long time to get anywhere. Now they just need to fill the hole with sand. But oh dear, Bump has to go all the way over there to get it. 
Ooh. Bump looks very gloomy. Ooh. Everyone is so much faster than him. <gasps> What's this? <gasps> Diggly has an idea. <laughs> oh, he's making some changes to Bump's engine. <laughs> now Bump is so much faster. <gasps> Whoa! Watch out, Mr. Rumble. Uh oh. Bump is speeding around out of control. Look out for that pile of dirt. Oh dear. Poor Bump. He's just not designed to go fast. Diggly is going to change him back. Later on, Diggly and Daisy are trying to load the sand into the sand pits. But it's taking them forever. But wait. With his big scoop, Bump can do that in no time. He may not move fast, but he can move things faster than anyone else. Nice work, Bump. He's very useful just the way he is. Hey, look. It's all the construction vehicles. Looks like they're repairing the road by Old McDonald's farm. See? Diggly and CJ are filling the pit with fresh concrete. Cool! <laughs> what is it, Diggly? Huh? Oh no! The barn is on fire! Huh? Oh, phew! Here comes Ashley the fire truck. Wait! Ashley, look out! The concrete is still wet. Oh no! Ashley's got stuck in the concrete. How will we put the fire out now? Johnny and Dozer are trying to get Ashley out. But be careful, guys. You'll get stuck too. Oh, no. The fire is still burning. What are we going to do? Wait a minute. I think Diggly has an idea. Wow, they're going to use all those pipes to form one long pipe. <laughs> then they're going to point it at the barn. And then go, Ashley! The water is travelling all the way down the pipe. There! The fire is put out! Way to go, Diggly! Now Diggly is digging Ashley out of the concrete. Everything is safe and sound now. Good job, everyone! <laughs> it's a winter's day at the construction HQ and all the crew are excited to get to work. Oh! Today they're building a windmill! Hooray! But... Oh dear, those dark clouds don't look good. They'd better get to work fast. In no time at all, the windmill is almost finished. Now the sails are on too. Now to test it. But wait, it's snowing. It's snowing a lot. Oh dear, Mr Rubble says they need to go inside or they'll catch colds. Mm. <gasps> Diggly wants to play mm. in the snow, but he has to go inside. Mm. Mm. The next morning, everyone is ready to get back to work. Oh look, uh -huh. there's so much snow outside. Mm. Oops. I don't think that'll work, Mr. Rubble. <laughs> Diggly can dig a path through the snow. There, now they need to reach the windmill. Ooh. Almost there. There, but the button is frozen up. Oh. 
This looks like a job for Daisy. There, no problem. Whoa! The windmill is blowing all the snow away. Great work, everyone. Now they have time to play. They can all slide down the snow drifts. Hooray! It's the construction crew. They're finishing their work on a new tunnel. Uh-oh. What's that sound? There's been a huge explosion down the mountain. Look, huge rolling snowballs. It's an avalanche. CJ tells the other workers to get inside the tunnel for safety. Dozer pushes Johnny in, there's no time to waste. Digley rushes to Daisy and tells her to get into the tunnel. The two get in just in time and the snow crashes down behind them. It's really dark in the tunnel. Digley grabs a lantern and goes to investigate the snowed in entrance. It looks too thick to dig through. Even Johnny can't dig through it. Digley starts investigating the rest of the tunnel. He can spot something up ahead. There are some train carriages on the tracks. The tracks lead deeper into the tunnel. Digley thinks that they can get on the train and escape out the other end of the tunnel. The construction crew have all jumped on the train. Dozer is nervous to be at the front. Johnny gives them a push and they're off! Whoa! It's like a giant roller coaster! Look at them go! Whoosh! This looks like fun! Uh oh! There is a snow blockage that they're going to crash into! Construction crew burst through the snow. They're outside and safe. Good job, Diggly and Dozer. It's Dozer, CJ and Diggly. <laughs> Looks like they've just finished building a brand new house. Good work, guys. But something's not right. Something is still missing. Of course. They need to colour the house in with paints. And that big paint mixing machine. Red first. Diggly is off. He's mixing the paint in the mixer. Ah. CJ is collecting it in her drum. She's giving the red paint to Diggly. And bingo, the roof is red. Well done, guys. Next up is blue. We have to mix it up. CJ collects the paint, gives it to Diggly and... There we go. The windows are blue. Nice work, Diggly. Which colour next? Yellow. Uh-oh. Diggly accidentally knocked the green paint over. That's not good. Diggly's mixing the yellow paint. He's painting the door yellow. But I don't think he realises the green paint is spilled. Huh? All gone. How will they finish painting now? Wait a minute. When the blue and yellow paints mix, it makes green. So if they take the yellow and blue paint cans and put them both in the mixer... There! Green paint. Nice work. Now you can finish painting the house. There! Green walls! The house is finished! Well done, Diggly Dozer and CJ! It's Christmas time at Construction HQ and everyone is really excited! But first they have work to do. They need to build a present moving machine. The presents go in here and come out here. But wait! They're building this for Santa? Diggly and Daisy are so excited, they might even get to meet Santa. Wow, in 
no time at all, the present wrapping machine is almost finished. <laughs> now it's time to test it. Diggly pulls the lever. Oh. Mr. Rubble puts the toy on oh. the conveyor belt. And out it comes all wrapped up. Oh. Pop! Yeah. Oops! Uh oh! <gasps> now the machine is running backwards. Oh dear, oh dear. Diggly's trying to turn the machine off. Oh no, now it's running faster. It's sucking the toys up. Oh no, it sucks Mr. Rubble up. Diggly and Daisy are trying to stop it. But they're not working together. Mr. Rubble's wrapped up like a present. But who's this? It's Santa. He can fix this mess. Santa snaps his fingers and... Phew, the machine is fixed. There's Mr. Rubble. He's still wrapped up. Phew, that's much better. Dickley and Daisy are sorry the machine went wrong. But it's okay. Santa knows just how to cheer them up. Whoa, a present eats for Diggly and Daisy. Amazing. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone. It's a bright new day at Construction HQ. Diggly and Daisy are so excited to see what they'll build today. Oh, wow. A Ferris wheel. This will be so much fun. Now they're at the fairground. The wheel is almost ready. Daisy is just lifting it up. Boing! There, it's finished. But who's going to take a ride in it first? Hooray! Diggly is having a go. Daisy throws the switch and up Diggly goes. But uh oh, something is wrong. Oh dear, the wheel stopped. Diggly is stuck at the top. There must be a way to get him down. Daisy has an idea. Whoosh! A pillow to jump on. I don't think that's going to work. Daisy will have to think of something else. She's off again. Whoosh! Look, now Daisy is trying to pull the wheel round, but it's no good. It's stuck tight. But now she has another idea. Blocks? I wonder what Daisy is up to. Whoa! She's built steps all the way up to Diggly. Here's Mrs. Skip. Oh wow! She's got a ramp to put on top of the blocks. They can turn it into a giant slide. Whee! That was so much fun! Diggly is fixing the wheel controls. Good as new. The Ferris wheel is ready. But look, Diggly and Daisy just want to use it to slide down the slide. It looks like so much fun. They haven't just built one fairground ride, they've built two. It's Diggly and Daisy doing some work on the farm. Uh oh, clumsy Daisy has knocked over a bit of fence. It's Pablo Pig. Cheeky Pablo, he's going to escape the farm. Quick, catch him before he gets away. Go on, Diggly, you can do it. Look, Carlos the calf is sneaking out too. Behind you, Daisy. He's running. Hurry after that calf. Now Pablo's balancing on the fence. Ouch, belly flop. Now he's off again. Whoa, spinning round so much has made Daisy dizzy. Oh no, now Dylan the duck is coming out. You've got to stop them, Daisy. Look out, Daisy. Ducks can swim, but you... Oh dear, those farm animals are really pesky. Pablo Pig is running into the wheat field. 
He must be hiding in here somewhere. There he is. And there's Litty Lamb too. After them, Diggly. Well done, Diggly. You caught Letty Lamb. Three more to go. That's still in the duck. And Carlos the calf too. Nice work, Daisy. Now you've caught Pablo too. All the animals are back safe and sound. Well done, Diggly and Daisy. With that fence repaired, they won't escape again. It's a very windy day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they'll be building today. Oh wow, the towpath for the canal. That looks amazing. To build a towpath, they'll need paving slabs. Here comes Rocky the riverboat to deliver them. Ooh, it is windy today. Rocky loves to listen to music on his big headphones. There, now to unload the slabs. Gently there. Thanks, Rocky. Now the crew can get to work on the towpath. But the wind is picking up. Oh no, Mr. Robble's hat. It's landed on the back of Rocky. Not to worry. Mrs. Skip can get it. She's even trying it on. Oh no, Rocky is sailing on. But he doesn't realise Mrs. Skip is still on the back. Come back, Rocky. He can't hear them because of his big headphones. What's Mrs. Skip going to do? She can't get carried off down the river. Who knows where she'll end up? They have to get Rocky's attention somehow. Watch where you're going, Mr. Rubble. Oops, Mr. Rubble hit a box. Diggly is racing ahead to try and stop Rocky. Maybe he can get his attention with this ball. Good thing Mrs. Skip has the helmet. Hmm, what's Daisy up to? She's brought the stack of slabs. I wonder what her plan is. She's hopping up on top. Hooray, she saved Mrs. Skip. She's back on dry land, safe and sound. Phew. Later on and the towpath is almost finished. Rocky is drifting past again, still listening to his music. He never knew anything was wrong. It's a brand new day at Construction HQ. All the vehicles are excited to get to work. I wonder what they're building today. Whoa, a pancake shop. Oh dear. Diggly doesn't look his usual happy self. I wonder what's wrong. Oh no, Diggly is sick. He can't work today, he'll have to stay home. <laughs> Time to start work. The first thing to do is dig the foundations. But without Diggly, how will they dig? <laughs> That's not working at all. Daisy can't dig the way Diggly does. Maybe this bro will help. Oops! Mother's going everywhere and Daisy can't keep the drill still. This isn't working either. Oh dear, oh dear. <gasps> Diggly is watching from HQ. He really wants to help, but he's still feeling sick. Here's Mrs. Skip with some medicine. That should help. Back on the building site. They still haven't dug the foundations. Oh dear. Splat! Wait, this plank of wood throws dirt into the air. Like a spade. Maybe they can use this to dig the foundations. Yes, it works! Good work, Daisy. She's found a way to dig in her own way. In no time at all. There, the pancake shack is finished. Aww, Daisy has brought some pancakes to Diggly to make him feel better. What a good friend. Mmm, delicious. Look, it's the construction crew. 
and they're building a castle. Diggly is directing Daisy as she lifts a big heavy block and puts it in place. CJ squirts the cement and... Done! One, two, three, four, five blocks on one side and one, two on the other. They're going to need some more blocks. Go, go, Dozer! One, two, three blocks across the drawbridge. Good job, Dozer! Oh no! It's a scary shark! Whoops! One of the blocks has fallen into the water. Poor Dozer, it was just an accident. Now Daisy has to lift the blocks into place. One, two blocks are left. They're really heavy. Careful, Daisy. Oops, they'll smash up. Oh no, Daisy's music got turned up really loud. She dropped the blocks. Phew, Diggly caught one of the blocks. But oh dear, the other smashed. How many are left? One, two, three, four, five on one side. One, two, three on the other. Oh dear, they don't match. But wait, I think Diggly has an idea. What's he up to? He's taking a block from the toddler tower. Five minus one is four. Now he's adding the block to the shorter tower. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. They match. Nice work, Diggly. It's the construction crew. Hard at work as usual. Good work, Diggly and Johnny. <laughs> Hmm, I wonder what's in that crate. Whoa, a yellow circle, a red triangle and a blue square. Diggly is right. The blue square will fit at the bottom of the tower. Go on guys, put it in place. Look out Dozer. Oh, well the square is in place at least. Here comes CJ. A little cement and... It's a door. I don't think Dozer liked being shut inside. Now the red triangle. Where does that belong? Aha! At the top of the flagpole. Go on, Diggly. Raise the flag. There. Well done, Diggly. Now just the yellow circle to go. I wonder where that goes. Oh, it's a clock, which means it belongs at the very top of the clock tower. Somebody will have to go all the way up there. Be brave, Diggly. It's high up, but you can do it. Ready, everyone? Heave! Up and up we go. Don't look down, Diggly. Almost there. Keep pulling. There. Careful, Diggly. Just gently put the clock in place. Well done. You did it. What a brave little digger Diggly is. See you next time. It's another sunny day at Construction HQ. I wonder what Mr. Rubble has in store today. Wow, they're building a crazy golf course. They're almost done in no time. Diggly and Daisy are putting in the finishing touches. Great, the windmill is in place. Now it's time to test it out. Mr. Rubble is going first. He's taking it very seriously. He hits the ball, it rolls over the hills, loops the loop, goes round the roundabout, through the pipe, and hang on, where is the ball gone? Aha, there it is. That's not right, it's gone off the course. Diggly hits the ball back up the chute. 
He's plugging the pipe with a cork to stop it from happening again. Very clever, Diggly. But where's it gone? Ouch! Watch out, Mr. Rubble! Mr. Rubble hits the ball around the bend. Now the windmill, but it's spinning way too fast. Watch out, everyone! Hmm, maybe they should change the speed of the windmill. There, that's better. Mr. Rubble tries again. And it's straight through and in the hole. Nice work, Mr. Rubble. It's Diggly's turn. The ball goes over the hills, loops the loop, round the roundabout, through the pipe, under the windmill. Wow, it's a hole in one. Now it's Daisy's turn. Whoa, slow down, Daisy. The ball bounces off the rock and hits Mr. Rubble. It bounces off the windmill and it lands in the hole. Hooray for Daisy! It's another windy day at Construction HQ. That wind really is blowing today. But today they're building a bigger enclosure for the sheep at the farm. Oh dear. The old sheep enclosure is far too small. Good job they're building a new one. That wind really is cold. And whoa, strong as well. But wait, what's Diggly seeing? Look, it's an old farm windmill, but it's wobbling all over the place in the wind. I think it's going to collapse. They have to stop it falling onto the sheep. Phew, good job, Daisy. Now it's falling towards the pigs. Uh-oh, look out. Phew, Daisy saved us again. Now it's falling back towards the sheep again. Oh dear, this is no good at all. What are they going to do? Wait, I think Diggly has an idea. Hmm, Diggly's climbed up on a box. He's taken the wheel off the top. Ah, he's taking the old tower apart from the top down so it can't fall over and hurt anyone. In no time at all, they've taken the tower apart. Now what can they do with all these planks of wood? They can recycle all the old planks from the tower and use them to build a bigger pen for the sheep. It's always good to build something new out of something old, instead of throwing things away. There, now the sheep have a much bigger place to play. Good job, everyone. It's still a bit windy. Uh-oh, Mr. Rubble's hat. One of the sheep has it. Now he's got to get it. Oh, Diggly has a new book. Everyone wants to see. It's all about dinosaurs. But Mr. Rubble is waiting. It's time to start work. Today they're building a roundabout. Soon everyone is hard at work. Diggly just wants to read his book. But now isn't the time. There's work to do. Wait, what's Diggly found? It looks like some old bones. I wonder what they are. Daisy's collecting them up. There are so many. Oh, I think they're dinosaur bones. Now they just need to put them together like a jigsaw puzzle. Everyone is helping put the dinosaur bones together. Done. Uh, that doesn't look right. Oh dear, they'll have to try again. What about now? No, that's not right either. But wait, on the front cover. That's it, it's a T-Rex skeleton. Now they know what it is, they can put it together properly. 
Nice work, everyone. <laughs> Now it can stand in the middle of the roundabout. It's a brand new day at Construction HQ and everyone's excited to start work. But Mr Rubble looks so tired. Oops, Daisy didn't mean to knock over all the plans. There, today's mm. plans. <gasps> but something's wrong. Huh? That playhouse doesn't look right. <sighs> oh well, if that's what the plans say, that's what they'll build. Now everyone's hard at work. But oh dear, Mr Rubble is so mm. sleepy. Surely no one will notice if he has a short nap. But Diggly can't figure this out. Something is definitely wrong with these plans. But what is it? There. The playhouse is nearly finished. They just need a few finishing touches. But oh no! It doesn't stand up properly. This isn't right at all. Here's Mrs. Skip. Oh. Looks like she's trying to say something. <laughs> hmm, that sign can spin upside Ooh. down. <gasps> That's it. The playhouse plans are upside oh. down. That's why yeah. it looks all wrong. Now there's just one thing left to do. <laughs> Three, two, <gasps> one, jump! <gasps> there. <gasps> that woke Mr. Rubble up. But the playhouse is the right way up now. Good job, everyone. The whole construction crew are getting ready for today's job. They're building that crumbly old building. That can't be right. Oh, they're demolishing the building. Daisy is so excited. Soon enough, it's time to get to work. The building looks like it could fall down any moment. It'll be safer to knock it down. Uh. Everyone is ready to get started. But wait, stop everyone. There's a little kitten beside it. Oh no, the kitten could get hurt if they knock it down now. Phew, Diggly stopped them just in time. They need to get the kitten out of harm's way. She's so cute. Ooh, I think Mr. Rubble's afraid of cats. The kitten ran back inside. Oh dear, they can't knock down the building with the kitten inside. Diggly's trying to get her to come out with some milk. Daisy wants to pet the kitten, but Diggly thinks that will frighten her. Oh no, Daisy accidentally hit the building. I think it's going to collapse. But the cat is still inside. What will they do? Maybe Mr Rubble can help. But he'll have to face his fear of cats. <gasps> Mr Rubble is small enough to fit inside. Phew, Mr Rubble saved the kitten. And just in time, that was a close one. Mr. Rubble was very brave to rescue the kitten. I think he's got over his fear of cats now. He's made a friend. It's a new day at the construction site. I wonder what they'll build today. Ooh, Mr. Rubble says they're going to build a car wash. Amazing. Everyone's working as a team to build the car wash. Now they just need to add soap. Oh dear, that barrel doesn't look like soap. But Bump hasn't noticed. Here's Mr. Rubble to take a look. Oh dear, he's all dirty. Not to worry, he can get all clean in the new car wash. 
Uh, oh dear, something's gone wrong. It turned Mr. Rubble green. I don't think he's noticed. They can't let him look in the mirror. Diggly's investigating. There's the problem. Bump put paint in the car wash, not soap. They'll need to paint Mr. Rubble back to the right colour. Splosh! Daisy splashed Mr. Rubble with mud. Now he'll need to use the car wash again. In Mr. Rubble goes. Oh no, now Mr. Rubble is blue. Quick! They need to stop him before he looks in the mirror. Splash! Nice work, Daisy. Now he needs to use the car wash again. Diggly's putting in another paint can. I hope this is the right colour. Into the car wash Mr. Rubble goes. Phew, he's back to his normal colour at last and squeaky clean too. Thank goodness. Looking good, Mr. Rubble. Good job, everyone. It's a bright sunny day at Construction HQ. Everyone is excited to start work. Today, they need to repair an old bridge that's collapsed in the middle. That'll be fun. The team arrive happily at the broken bridge. Wow, look at all the holes. But they need to get their planks at the far side to fix it. Where's Daisy going? Whoa, Mr. Rubble almost got knocked over the edge. Daisy can't get over the gap. But maybe she can reach the planks with a hook. Oh, nearly. Give it another go. Oh no, she's knocked it into the river. But at least Daisy tried. What are they going to do now? Diggly's got it. He's going to try and reach across. Watch out, the plank is collapsing. Phew, great save Daisy. But how are they going to get across and get those planks? Wait a minute. I think Diggly has a plan, watching Daisy's hook swing back and forth. Oh, they're going to swing Mr. Rubble over the gap. That's a long way down, and Mr. Rubble doesn't like heights. He's nervous, but Diggly and CJ are encouraging him. Go on, Mr. Rubble. Be brave. You can do it. Mr. Rubble is swinging. This isn't so bad. It's actually great fun. He's having a great time. He can grab the planks on that side and deliver them to the crew on the other side. Now, with a bit of cement to stick it, the bridge will be repaired in no time. There, all done. Good job, team. But look. Mr. Rubble is still swinging. He's having so much fun, he doesn't want to stop. It's a really sunny day at Construction HQ. All the crew are having fun playing with a beach ball. Ha, nice one, Mr. Rubble. Now today, they're putting up some traffic lights. In no time at all, they're nearly done. Daisy's just putting the last traffic light up. And now Diggly has to plug them in. There. The lights are all turning on. Oh, they've gone out. Back at HQ, Mr. Rubble's playing with the ball. What's happening to the lights? Now Mr. Rubble is stuck in the dark. Hmm, the power has all gone. That's very strange. Here's the electricity cable. It looks okay. I wonder where it leads. Diggly's going to follow it. Mr. Rubble is still stuck in the dark. Diggly and Daisy are following the cable all through the construction site. Oops! It's leading them right through this muddy puddle. Yuck! And even under this archway. Look out, Daisy! But where does it lead? Look! An electricity generator. Look at all that smoke. It must have broken down. That's why the power cut out. How will they get electricity now? Wait, I think Daisy has a plan. The sun. 
They can use solar panels to make power from the sunshine. Very clever, guys. Daisy puts the last one in place. With all those panels, they should have lots of power. CJ's trying the switch. Hooray! The lights are back on. It worked. Good job. Oh, Mr. Rubble has got into a real mess while he was stuck in the dark. 